Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're diving into a common challenge faced by many developers. Our viewer asks, property subscribe does not exist on type promise. Let's break down the issue. Our viewer is building an Ionic app that successfully retrieves data from a server using an HTTP POST request. However, they're facing a hurdle when it comes to passing an authentication token, which they need to retrieve from storage before making the request. The error arises because the method getPlanograms returns a promise, but the viewer is trying to subscribe to it as if it were an observable. This is a common confusion when working with RxJS and promises. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you find that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. To address the issue you're facing, we need to understand that the error occurs because you're trying to call subscribe on a promise, which doesn't have that method. In your current implementation, the getPlanograms function returns a promise from the storage.get method. Instead, we want to return an observable from the HTTP POST request. To achieve this, we can use the RxJS from operator. This allows us to convert the promise returned by storage.ready and storage.get into an observable. Finally, in your IonViewDidLoad method, you can now subscribe to the observable returned by getPlanograms, allowing you to handle the data as expected. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To resolve the issue with the subscribe property not existing on a promise, this user implemented a function that retrieves planograms using an API. They utilize observables to handle the asynchronous call. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. In the latest version, the request options is deprecated. Instead of observable.fromPromise, you should now use from. Also, flat map has been replaced with merge map and you need to pipe to merge map. Make sure to import the necessary dependencies from RxJS and Angular's HT client. This includes observable, throw error, of, from, and various operators. Here's a function example that retrieves products. It gets a token from storage, sets up headers, and makes an HTTP GET request using the HTTP client. And that's it. I hope this video has helped you get through to that resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. And until next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.